I'm Christine. I'm here at the Nye County Commissioner's Chambers, where we heard from several people who live here in Nye County. Most of them are not in favor of this music festival. They say they're concerned with things like traffic and dust and sanitation. Commissioners heard from the public. They heard from festival organizers. And in the end, they say there are just too many variables to give it the green light. People who live in Nye County spoke loud and clear about where they stand on the Peace Stock Music Festival. They say this is a non-drug, no drugs, no alcohol. Who are you trying to kid? I'm also concerned about, oh, gee, uh, no smoking out here. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean for that whole area to go up in flames. I live out there. I'm just so scared of fire more than anything. County commissioners say their priority is to the people who live in Nye County and not festival goers. Hearing the facts, hearing the gentleman state that he had no experience in actual events and not having the event coordinator there, um, I just, I have a I have a duty to the public health and safety. I think that's uh, of utmost importance. That's part of the job. That's why we're there. And sometimes we have to make tough decisions. The government is responsible to these people, whether we have a festival or not. What are you going to do for them if these people are wandering around all the desert? Taking a crap everywhere, dumping their garbage, setting fires. Festival organizers say their event grew out of the Storm Area 51 Facebook event. And since people are going to show up anyway, having a plan is better than the alternative. All of the concerns would have been addressed. Uh, at the end of the day, we didn't make a compelling argument. And I guess they don't really feel that it's um, a state of emergency for them. Nye County commissioners say they are working with the sheriff's department out here to come up with a plan in the event that thousands of people come out here thinking that the festival is still going on. They're still working with on that plan. They haven't provided any specifics yet. Meanwhile, festival organizers say they're not giving up. They say they have two more locations in mind where they won't need county commissioner's approval. Uh, they're meeting with the Amaragosa town board on the 27th of this month to discuss that. Reporting live, I'm Enzo Marino, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.